Jill Husser, a realtor and broker owner of my own real estate firm in Florida. Today I'm going to talk about creating a social media plan that will convey your message as a real estate agent and brand and gain you more loyal customers. Social media for a business can be a really awesome tool to help you get your message out and create a loyal fan base of customers. But oftentimes there's a struggle of what to post on social media. Agents are not sure of what to say, how often to say it, and what platform is the best to use. We're going to scratch the surface on this topic today. Let's start with where do you post? The answer depends on where you spend your time socially, where you have the most friends and what platform you're most comfortable with using. I would recommend YouTube, Facebook, or Instagram, or a combination of all three. Whichever you pick, Pick it and stick with it. Consumers will want to see your face and if you're not consistent with your social marketing, it won't gain momentum and you won't see results. Within each of the three social apps, YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram, each of them have a go live function and Facebook and Instagram have stories, which can be used as highlights of your day and will disappear after 24 hours. I'm pointing out these features because they're all just as important to use as it is to post on the profile pages. The next hot button question from agents is, where do I post? I'm going to answer this with a question. Who is your target audience? Craft your social posts to speak to them. Do you work primarily with first-time home buyers? Post about tips to help first-time home buyers save money and build their credit score to enable them to purchase. Or speak about the process of purchasing a home. Use social media to educate your ideal customers. The more content you provide to them on a regular basis, the more you set yourself up to be the expert in your niche. If you have more than one niche you market to, rotate the topics around the post to be sure you're covering all niches frequently. Do you create videos for your customers? If so, repurpose the video content in some of your social posts. Break the tips in your videos down and create one to five different posts about the content in the video. Gain more traffic to your videos by referencing the video link in the post. If they want to hear more about X topic, please go watch my video on my YouTube channel or something like that. To get your posts noticed more and create familiarity when customers see your posts on their newsfeed, increase your brand awareness by creating a cohesive themed profile. By that I mean choose your brand colors and style and use those colors in similar style posts with each post. For example, if you have blue in your logo, use blue in your posts. If you like a particular font style, use that same font style in each post. This will also create trust. To boost engagement of each post, share a story about your post. Did you just sell a home? Don't just tell people you sold a home. Tell them the story behind the selling of the home. How did, the, how did you meet the seller? What obstacles did you overcome to get the home sold? How did you help the seller move on from the home? Were they moving to be closer to their family in another state and you helped them realize that dream? Tell the positive side of the story behind selling the home. This is what customers want to hear. Lastly, and like so many topics I speak about, be consistent with your social media marketing. Showing up in front of your customers on a regular and frequent basis is key. Post at least once per day, if not one to three times per day. Plan your content ahead of time so it takes the guesswork out of posting when it's time to post. I set time aside each month to batch or plan out the content I'm going to share with my social friends. Then when it's time to post, I copy and paste and grab the pre-selected photo and upload everything into my social. There are also apps available which will do the same thing for you and schedule it out to a T, so it's really hands off for you. I found a system that works for me and you'll need to find a system which works best for you. That wraps up the simple and easy guidelines for creating a cohesive and informative social media plan that will attract your ideal customer. If you found this video helpful, please share it with your friends in real estate so they can learn from it too. Till then, Thank you for watching and I will see you soon.